So Australia is running an experiment on what happens when you don't have the equivalent of the Communications Decency Act Section 230 on the books. In Australia, it appears that the High Court has determined that media companies are liable for the content that any other user posts to their website or Facebook page. And this is something that a lot of people think should be adopted in the United States because they feel that tech companies have too much power and they're silencing voices. Though to date, they've been hamstrung by Section 230 and uh, the First Amendment to the US Constitution. Now, I am not an Australian lawyer, take this with a grain of salt, I'm doing my best to parse what I can see coming out of the Australian courts. But at first blush, this decision seems to be the opposite of Section 230 and that media companies might be liable for these comments. So they will be running a natural experiment as to what actually happens when the internet doesn't have the equivalent of the First Amendment or Section 230. And I'm as interested as you are in finding out what kind of unintended consequences, if any, come as a result of this finding.